now we are, we have possibly just found our cave. Uh, this is not easy and accessible. Yes it is, look at that. It's not easy, we have like This can work, Kai. Dude, but it's just it's so loud. Yeah, but like for the trailer? Dude, that looks so freaking cool. Look at that. in the wind. Thirty years I have waited to feast. And I am famished. This is what I've trained for. All of my life has led me here. Yes, sire. Nicodon did not kill the men you sent. But there are no worries. Your banners laid them to rest. Is that it? A simple execution? This is not worthy of my time. Send out my scroll, speaker. You are a weak excuse for a swordsman. My skills outweigh yours. By ten, fold. Yeah. You are the one the band chooses. It is disgraceful. I am Talamore. 
heir of Dion and Elspeth, ally to Athelos and Rowan, your baron. We have missed something. Something very important. It was with us all this time. had destroyed their village then to return in four days to finish the destruction of their home. That was way too, like, whispery, like... You did not sound very excited. I didn't want to say name, but it's called. Okay. You can change it. named Nekodon, who had destroyed the village and who has threatened to destroy the village in four days if he is not vanquished. Say it is, because you said, you only said is. Oh. This is the Cavern of Necrodon. It is a medieval fantasy film about the warriors who were chosen by the Baron to slay a vicious dragon called Necrodon. The beast had destroyed their village then to return in four days to finish the destruction of their home. The warriors traveled through many lands in order to reach Necrodon, eventually realizing that a sinister secret had been kept from them, and their village is soon to meet a much different fate than they ever expected. This film will utilize knowledge that we have learned over the past four years in our film academy. This includes using cinema cameras, high quality equipment, set building, creating costumes, creature effects, special effects, makeup, and more. Since this is our last film of this year, we're looking forward to doing everything we can to make this our best film yet. Now the only issue is, since we're high school, we don't have much of a budget. And this is where you come in. We need your help to make this happen. You may be wondering where these funds are going towards. Most of the funds are going to be going towards costumes, props, and camera equipment. Any support will be appreciated, whether it's big, small, or even just a share on social media. All and any donations will go directly into bringing this film to life. Once we have finished filming, all equipment bought will be given back to our film academy to support future students. So far, we have managed to get a lot of pre-production completed, including majority of casting, set building, creating a dragon head, as well as storyboarding and managing our shooting locations. We want to thank everyone for taking interest in this film, as well as the support we've gotten already. We'll do everything we can to make this film happen. Where are we, Kevin? Dry Creek Preserve. We're location scouting. It's spring. Everything's blooming. You got flowers and colors everywhere. It's tight.
kind of perfect this little corner. We would just have to uh, kind of pull those wires. Yeah. Uh, wait, wires. Oh, those. Okay. What do you think? I think this section is pretty good. Right? Yeah. We can take a few pictures of the outside and maybe the surrounding area. What? It's like wow, dude. That's crazy. Wait, dude. There's like. Give it a scroll. The watch dogs are like when they come up again because the trash they so this is around. so this is a lot of space, but. Some of the notes I should make while filming this, we do need to bring a generator because there isn't any electricity. Um, they're installing solar right now, so the electricity got knocked out, which is fine. This is one of the other areas. It's open, which is nice, but um, it, it's about that big. It could work, but I don't know. You ever been space-wise? I do like it. Space-wise, space I, like, I like that one over there. Oh. I mean, but here, here's the other thing. If we want to film, like... Exterior is going to be difficult for like, because Athlos leaves in the scene, right? Yeah. So. Oh, yeah, it's a. Oh, it's a, oh dang. Okay. We could always. Can you see in there? <laughs> yeah, we can see. It's, it's. It's dark, but. It's dark, but yeah, it's. Yeah. Actually, this may not be too bad. You, okay. you, this is cool. But you guys are going to need a lot of prep time if you're going to use uh, this space, you know what I mean? Yeah, we can imply like that there's a window right here or something and have some light in here. Yeah. Uh, you know? I guess we could, yeah. As long The only issue is then we could show this wall. You know what I mean? If, we, if we're in, inferring that there's a window there. Yeah, or from right here. You can, you know, any direction, really. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The other thing is we really need to figure out that generator situation. Okay, so just to kind of do a quick walkthrough, um, the front, you're going to drive down the right side lane, and you're going to walk around the house. You're just going to walk this way through a gate, and you'll see this uh, bar. Uh, so one of the things that's kind of important is once we're done, we have to put that wooden plank back on the kind of lock thing just to keep the barn doors closed. But yeah, uh, pretty good location. Uh, I'll go ahead and take some more photos, but we definitely do need to clean up this area. To do the uh, structure, the steel, just have that assurance and strength. Mm -hmm. the, the, the tower inside is just a shell, it's just full of scaffolding. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's scaffolding right now. But isn't that mysterious? Uh, yeah, of course. It looks, it looks, we'll be allowed to. Yeah, that'd be amazing. That'd be sick. Oh. So, Kevin, can you give me some cool shots? Yeah, of course. I mean, this is like, you got the spiral. yeah, this is, has to be something like, shoot from like, bird's eye. It's really, really tight for anything. Yeah, a lot, of, a lot of I don't know, you know, it's just the vision as I go along. That's super neat. That's Seems that one happening out here, or would you be coming back and forth? Um, if we prepare, we can do it in like a weekend, like two days. Um, obviously, if you want to give us more time, okay. we would be more than happy to have more time, but it, we can do it in two days. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, that's neat. Watch that. Yes, sir. Whoa, careful, slippery guys. Where's the Baron's taking a bath in here? <laughs> oh, dude. Like, yeah. you have it just sitting here? Oh, yeah, this is like. Yeah, this. Well, there's a, a leak in the roof. Okay, right, like right now, this is uh, got materials in it. But uh, it's a uh, concrete passageway. There's nothing yeah. steps here. Yeah, right, Oh, yeah, heck yeah. 
So we're at Bear Cave and we chose Bear Cave because it's not public land and people don't really come here often so we could just go in and shoot and it's very close to us. It's only an hour away. And we didn't need permits but the only bad thing is that it's next to the road and when the car drives by it gets kind of loud but overall that's the worst thing. And people stop. And yeah they stop but it might be home to cultists. We don't know. Eh, who cares. We are at Slick Rock, a recreational area, which is owned by the U.S. Army Corps. And we've met the people who own this place. They're pretty cool. They're pretty cool. Very nice. Pretty nice people. Um, it's a really beautiful area, especially right now. It's getting green. The clouds, it's raining. It looks pretty. It is really pretty. Okay. Um, we're here to location scout for our reshoots. Um, we're doing that tomorrow, actually. So today's Tuesday, tomorrow's Wednesday. Yep. It's the 27th. I'll bring canopies. Change. I'll bring canopies. Yeah, I can definitely see this being a nice backdrop when it's uh, foggy and stuff. This could look very nice. Like he could totally just be walking down here. Like with like, um, do we have props for him? Props? Um, I have a net, and I have, we need, what do we need, like a stick or something? What should we have? Um, like, a, like one of those, one of those sparring poles. Let's bring a sparring pole, and let's bring uh, a bag and a net, and that'll be his fishing gear. I, I probably and have maybe, some bow lap at home I can make into, a, like, a bag. So either here, or a little bit upstream. But we got to make sure we have space to do both finding her dead... Banner's taking her away and him on the hill. Although, I think for the hill part, we probably want to move. It'd be like what we shot come home. That way. This actually, oh, Noah, look. What's up? What's right up? Right there. Oh, yes. Okay, this is nice. I like right, this. You think this could work for where she gets taken? Because she could lay on that sandy patch. Here, let's, let's. If we find like a good looking stick, I can make it into a fishing pole. Okay, why not? Let's do it. And they'll bring the net too. Yeah. Throw some fish in there. Have them like dragging it on the ground. Hey, we're on the other side of Slick Rock right now. We were just on the other, the opposite end. Uh, this is where we shot mostly uh, our World War II film Come Home uh, back in 2021. Um, so we're just looking around here to see if we can find like anything else, like, you know, good locations we can use for tomorrow. Um, really like how those clouds are sitting nice and low. That looks really pretty, really, really pretty. So if we shoot this way, I think this would look the best. Well, they could be walking and then you see a banner in front of them and like they stop and then Bowen turns around and then the, another one comes up behind them. And then look, look straight ahead. The little clearing on the top of the mountain. Oh yeah, that's so sick, dude. All right, let's get out of here. I'll call Slick Rock in the car when we get back up. Uh. I got it. Oh yeah, if you can send me a few, this is amazing. We are at Leonard Park practicing choreography for the fight scene. Which fight scene? Um, the big one outside, the not throne room one. No, do you need to balance this? Oh, you mean the turkey? Yeah. yeah. It's a, do you even need to balance I love this? That movie. That movie so honestly, just, it's just recording. I don't think you need to balance this at all. How do you lock this? <laughs> so sketchy, bro. What's happening? Is it sharp? Maybe yeah, you imagine, like, you go over somebody's house and they're like, <laughs> not at all. <laughs> they just fucking, here you go. And you're like, like, from the back to cut some steaks. <laughs> giving turkey. Yeah, it's like a turkey. <laughs> Why'd you get the pirate sword? If That's we can find spot. a cave that looks like a cave entrance. And it comes with a little clip. For but no not necessarily no something that we could fit like a dragon head into. Yeah. Would that work or do we need something that's workable, like internal space? Right, what's your stance, dude? Uh, no, jumping in the forest. What's happening today, Kai? Yeah. Choreography. 
Rush. How you guys feeling about choreography today? Hey, my bad. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Ask him. Yeah, How am so I swinging? Am I going? Character. Okay. Yeah. So one. Go for your head. Two. Go for your head. Go for your head. Go and then leg. leg. Okay. No, you go I like that. You see how I'm doing it? Like oh, so I'm going. I'm going this way. Yeah. I got. Okay. Okay. So it's one, two, three, four. Okay. So I'm going there, and then other way to there. Okay. That's uncomfortable. Okay. Why the break? No, this is what you do when that ball con yesterday. I just glued it. That has right. What are we doing today, Noah? I'm gonna, I'm gonna smack Kevin. You smack Kevin? Smack Kevin. Should I shoot this in cinematic? Or should I shoot do it? Do it. In? Well, what does cinematic cinematic do? It just gives bokeh. Can you still do, uh, do like ultra wide? I, I can do 4K Pro Res for ultra wide. Bro. Can you not do ultra wide on um, cinematic? Mode? No, you can't. I can do, you want me to do Pro Res? 4K24 Pro Res? <laughs> It isn't. I mean, you could. You, yeah, I mean, when you're shooting this, that'd be yeah. uh, But uh, for cinematic, just like. I mean, if you're going wide, just use wide. If you're going tight, you use cinematic, I guess. I don't know. It doesn't, need to look, it doesn't need to look fantastic. As long as the camera moves themselves are there and the uh, choreography is in the view. So, what kind of choreography are you looking for? Disconnect. Cool stuff. Cool right. stuff? Like what? Talk me through it. Mm. Oh. I put some notes. I put some notes. One of my notes was uh, Talamore should fight at least one person and Rowan should fight two. Okay. And we should show all four banners on screen at once. I think we should. But we cut the scene where they're like, they're, walk, they're like standing around. Like they're like waiting for Mm. Oh, Alright, yeah, Kevin, explain the camera setup. What are you shooting today? Uh, Rowan and an iPhone, Pro, iPhone 13 Pro Max. Nice. That's all we're working on. Looks sick. Yeah, shooting on cinematic mode. That's pretty neat. <laughs> nice. Well, then it would be technically afternoon. Oh, do we have that today? All right. How you feel about Corey? Hey. Fantastic. I think I might leave a, lose a finger or two, but we'll be all right. We're good. We're good. So you ready to do sticks against swords? Sticks against swords. Yeah, I'll choose the sword side. Okay. I'll take okay. the sword. Yeah. Interesting. Interesting take. Yeah. yeah. Like shirts, shirts versus skins. <laughs> You have a portrait mode, bro? Uh, we have notes. <laughs> so we're recording portrait mode. <laughs> that does not look right at all. It's, it's, um... I don't know. Oh, with the bird. You know what I mean? But, it, but the twist is revealed by them seeing the, the voice. This guy. Um, this guy. We, out, we see the yeah. voice in the banners. You're gonna die. Yeah. You eat that. <laughs> <laughs> Bro's hungry. <laughs> Just like Caesar. Oh, kind of like the original one. That's Isaiah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, one I Oh, really? Yeah. I, 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 is he dead there? He's named Brandon. Oh, bro. And then that's like the moment. Let's Come around to do this, and then just come oh, back around. Yeah. Just up the come around. Yeah. Up under the helmet. I see the voice. I'm running after the voice. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh! <laughs> 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 you want to try it again?